Just a very brief couple of words. Um, it's absolutely clear to us in the Equality Commission that working to counter and reduce prejudice and promote good relations in society between people, between groups, is absolutely intrinsic to tackling um, inequality, to reducing inequality. So this has been a very important uh, morning for us. It's clear prejudicial attitudes can lead to behaviours which sustain inequality um, and exclusion in a whole range of areas, and it's very important um, that we all play our part in tackling those. Um, I, I think for us, we've met our goals this morning. We've shared the results of our um, survey with you. I, I feel we've had a good discussion. Um, I know it's not um, the end of it. I know it will be ongoing um, with all of you, both individually and through your organisations. Um, and I know that we all have a job of work to do um, to tackle the, the prejudicial attitude that can lead to um, inequalities and, and, and poor treatment. Um, on a very practical sense, um, I have four things to say, if I get them right. The handsets are um, cost loads of money each, so please don't make off with any of them and leave them on your seats. Um, as Tara said, some of the questions that came forward were about individual issues, and we're very happy, and indeed it would be important for you to take them up with us, so there's you know, a few staff um, around, please do <coughs> ask a member of our team about us or, 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 or contact um, us. I was also asked to remind you to fill in the evaluation forms, which are in your packs, and also if you have indicated you have any special dietary requirements, please again speak to a member of the team because there must be some provision being, there's obviously some provision um, being made um, for you. Um, so last um, and not least, I, I wanted to thank Tara Mills, first of all, for um, moderating our, our session this morning. You did it very well and we're very appreciative. Thank you, um, Tara. And if you've got, well, there you go, round of applause. Thank you. And I hope you've picked up a few more viewers for your shows. And um, I'd like to thank very much the, the panel members, Malachi, George, Fidelma, Francis and Rory, who all you know, came having not had the research very long before they came here, but came and gave very valuable insights into how their, how their reflections on it um, and, and how they're going to use it, as well as dealing with the questions you've raised. So thank you to all of the panel members. It would be wrong for me not to say thank you to Darren and his research team there, Seamus and Laura, sitting here for all the hard work they've done in, in, uh, in this research. And also to Libby, well, there you go. Um, and Libby and Deborah and the communications team for making us all arrive here on time, have a nice morning, and, and uh, all the media and so on that goes with that. So thank you to our communications staff um, as well. And last but not least, um, thank you all very much for your participation this morning. You know, I certainly have felt it's been a very valuable engagement we've had with you. I can hear lots of buzzing conversation going on, and I'm very hopeful that that will continue in our joint endeavour to um, tackle prejudice and inequality in Northern Ireland. So thank you very much to all of you as well.